Hi, I'm Julie, and I'm from Detroit. On behalf of the Dean of Students Office, and as the creator and director of Diversity Players, an educational theater group here at Iowa State University, we want to welcome you to our campus. Today, the Diversity Players would like to talk to you about four themes that we feel are important to your success as a college student. The first theme is about involvement and why becoming involved in campus activities really can be a critical component to your success here. The second theme we'd like to highlight has to do with responsibility. The good news is you're on your own now. The bad news is you're going to be held accountable for your actions. We want you to think about that before you arrive on campus. We also want you to think about respecting diversity. Respect is going to be very important at Iowa State because we draw scholars and students and faculty from really all around the world. We want you to be able to join our team and feel comfortable here and think about what respecting diversity would mean, not only in terms of enriching your college experience, but your life experience as well. Finally, we want you to be aware of what resources are available to you here after you arrive on campus. The Dean of Students Office will be your best resource for connecting to campus activities and also as a place to turn whenever you have questions or concerns. Going away to college is a lot of fun. It's also a lot of hard work, so I hope you're prepared to study. It's about chasing your dreams and meeting new friends and pursuing academic excellence. As a diversity player, I want to welcome you not only to Iowa State, but to also have you start thinking about how you're going to join this new community. Because going away to college is also about joining a community that may be very different from the one that you're living in today. We want to orient you to that today and also wish you well on your journey. Hi, I'm Kimberly, and I'm from Fort Dodge, Iowa, and I'm here to talk to you about initiative and getting involved on the Iowa State campus. When I first came here as a freshman, I was completely overwhelmed by all the opportunities that I saw around me. I was living in the dorms with uh, mostly other freshmen lived on the dorm floor as well, and we were all so scared and nervous about this new big world that surrounded us known as Iowa State and how we were going to fit into that world because we saw all the upperclassmen and they seemed to fit in so well, and why were we experiencing these feelings? But I, what we realized is that college isn't high school, and it's really a fresh start for you to get involved in ways that you never thought possible. Um, and my friends that lived on the dorm floor started doing that as well. Everybody found new and interesting ways that they could get involved that they never imagined would be available to them. I'm a theater major, and I started out wanting to do theater. I'd done it in high school, but I was really afraid about how college theater would be different than high school theater and how I would fit into that. So I heard about an audition that I read in the paper, and so I went to the theater to audition for the show, and I walked in the building, and I sat in the back of the house, and I watched people on stage, and I, as soon as I saw those people on stage, I ran out the building and left and ran all the way home back to the dorm floor to all the friends and was absolutely terrified at what had just happened. I don't know why, I was just so overwhelmed by seeing people older than me, and they looked so comfortable, and I felt so afraid. So I had, got a pep talk from my friends. I headed back to the theater when I saw that they were having another audition and took everything that I could and got up on that stage and auditioned and ended up getting cast in my first show and I've done numerous shows since then and after that making that first step of getting involved I've been able to get involved in so many other ways on campus be it theater organizations hosting a TV show at Iowa State, um, political organizations, campus-wide organizations, uh, all sorts of different opportunities that I've had available to me and I think what's important about that is that you realize that it's going to be nervous for everybody that gets here. Everybody's going to be afraid about how they'll fit in. And what's important is that you make that first step for yourself as to what you want to do because there's so many opportunities that are overwhelming here. You need to decide what you want to do and just go for it. Um, because college just isn't about classes. It's about what you do in your free time that establishes you as an individual. It's about the friends that you will make through those opportunities, friends that will last you a lifetime, the friends that I have now are the ones that I've made through those opportunities that I've taken. So I want to welcome you to Iowa State and I hope that you take every opportunity that is available to you.
Hi, I'm John and I'm from Clinton, Iowa. I'd like to talk to you about responsibility. Now, nothing I'm going to say is going to be new or earth-shattering or stuff you haven't heard before, but it's stuff that I've found to be important in my life, so I'd like to share it with you. First, it's important to make decisions before you get into situations. For example, if you're going to go to a party, it's best to decide if you want to drink and how long you want to stay before you get there. That way, when you get to the party, you don't have to worry about being pressured into doing something you don't want to do. Next, it's always best to follow your gut instinct. Normally, what you feel is the right thing to do is the best way to go. And finally, now that you're at, now that you're at Iowa State, you're going to have a lot more freedom. But with that freedom comes responsibility. So for every action you do, there's going to be a consequence, whether it be in class, at a party, in the dorms, wherever. Now, like I said, nothing I said is new or earth-shattering, but it's stuff that has held true in my life, and I think it will hold true in yours as well. Welcome to Iowa State. Hi, I'm Nick. I'm from Wisconsin. When I first came to Iowa State University, I wasn't quite sure what to expect. Being an out-of-state student and a gay man, I had this fear that I would be rejected, that everyone here was closed-minded. Yet, I found out that I was wrong, especially when I moved into the residence halls. Every person I met, including my roommate, were very respectful of me and my differences. They realized that we were all different, and each person needed to be respected for it, whether it's race, ethnicity, gender, uh, political beliefs, religious beliefs, uh, disability, uh, age. We're all respected here at the Iowa State campus, and that's what makes studying here at Iowa State very unique, is this respect that we have going on. I know that I've really enjoyed studying here at Iowa State. Uh, this respect that we have going on has helped me immensely. I hope you enjoy it too. Welcome to Iowa State. Hello, I'm Duffy. And I'm from Ames, and I am a student at Iowa State University. I have a disability, and I am a non-traditional student. As you can see, I could be a grandmother. As a student with a disability and a non-traditional student, I was afraid that I wouldn't belong. But I found that when I used the correct support mechanism, I could belong just as well as any other student. I also found that I had strengths. Because I have a disability, I am used to asking for accommodations, for self-advocating. So I didn't find it a problem to ask questions in class. Also, I've had a job and a family. I'm used to planning my time, and that is a real strength. I hope that perhaps you can use some of these strengths and that you will find family and community at Iowa State, just as I have. Hi, I'm Linda, and I'm from Connecticut. And just like you, a couple of years ago, I was sitting in those same seats wondering, what am I going to do? I had just arrived on campus, and I was petrified because this campus was larger than my hometown. But you know what? I went to one of my resident assistants, and you know what they told me? Go to the dean of students' office. So I went over to the student services building, and guess what I found? A whole bunch of resources. I found out that they were the people who were in charge of student activities, and I was a person who was very involved in high school. I was involved in many different groups, and I couldn't imagine not being involved on campus. So they directed me over to the student activities office, where I found all types of groups. Greek life, groups for underrepresented people. Then I also was very involved with women's issues, so they directed me over on the other side of campus to the Women's Center. I also am a health nut, love to work out, and I didn't realize that the Recreation Center was also a part of the Dean of Students Office. I also found that there were offices there that would give me tutors if I need them. There were offices there that would give me peer mentors if I just needed someone on my own level to talk to. There were so many resources. I, at first, I was overwhelmed. But I enjoyed the office so much, I got to meet great people, and I now am a peer mentor for the Student Support Services Office, which is in the Dean of Students Office. So I say to you, you're sitting there right now, you're wondering, I'm never going to survive on this campus. But that's not the case. To make one stop in the Student Services Building, in the, student, in the Dean of Students Office, and you'll find resources on top of resources and people that are willing to help you. Just take that first step, and your stay here at Iowa State would be great. I wish you all the luck, and I know you'll do great.